recently, our president, Joe Biden, just signed an executive order in regards to crypto. And it was just Wednesday. He's mobilizing the federal government to order a strategy around digital assets like cryptocurrency. This order directs the Federal Reserve to research and potentially develop its own digital dollar. Yes, people, U.S. government sees an opportunity to make a big investment and now they want to invest in currency for the United States as a whole? Okay, so tell me. And I'm the only one tripping. Tell me, along with all the American people, all the American people, tell me this is not a huge sign that the dollar bill could be collapsing faster than what we think. U.S. government and Federal Reserve preparing for the inevitable you see where where the world going people you see the world massive homelessness homeless tents all across the country inflation's up gas prices is up food is up every necessity is through the roof an economic war, I mean an economic war is going on. And we're in it. It's time to understand people, it's time to understand what's ahead of us in these times. Instead of taking priority, investing in the fake world, we have tremendous amount of work in the real world to do people. And we have to put our best foot forth. At this time, 2019, a lot of people is not returning back to work. I don't say what the government is telling us. They're saying we're adding more jobs. Okay, you're adding more jobs in the month of January. It's March. But is people going back to work? No, they're not going back to work. Tell us the truth. Tell us the truth. You got all these jobs that's open. Quite sure, all across the country, you can go to any retail establishment, any retail store, and what do you see in the window? Help wanted. Hiring now. So, I can't tell you why people is not returning to work. Maybe it's due to the mandates. Maybe, just maybe. Maybe it's... People is finally waking up and realizing they can own their own business. They can take control of their own destiny. And that's why I'm here. I want to take control of my own destiny. I want to build a better future for myself. I don't want to leave this in the hands of nobody else but myself. Now here's the government working on a new world currency, a cryptocurrency, and there's way too much fiat currency, there's way too much cryptocurrency out there and around the world. And with cryptocurrency, now that the government is being involved, there's going to be regulations. There will be regulations. At the end of the day, only one or two cryptocurrencies can evolve and stay around for the long haul. Which cryptocurrency is it? You know, we have Bitcoin, we have Ethereum, we have a wide range of cryptocurrencies. But we're $30 trillion in debt as a nation. Thirty trillion dollars, people. We're printing money left and right, hand over fist. Defaulting on loans, on mortgage payments. They put things in our way that we supposedly need, but all it does is put us in debt. 
if we're headed to a digital version of the dollar, the US dollar, and banks rising up and investing in a crypto and this whole decentralized economy, they're making a big move in Wall Street. They're making a big move in the White House. And US President Joe Biden has signed an executive order. Keep your eyes open, people. Keep your ears open, people. My suggestion is to make strides in life, to be independent, to focus on you, making a better self, a better you. Because at the end of the day, you and whoever's in your circle, kids, mother, father, aunties, uncles, we all we got. We got to stay clicked up, people, and remain focused on what matters in life. Stay real, stay focused, and subscribe to Clicked Up TV. Peace. I'm out.